hey everyone welcome back to our channel uh, let me show you a quick uh, demo of how you can use ai for your interview preparation and uh, how it can be an assistive tool that would empower you to better prepare so let's say we are on the devtools tech platform and uh, i'm implementing this question impl uh, count by which is basically similar to low dash count by uh, these low dash type of questions are commonly asked in companies as problem solving questions in machine coding rounds. So now I'm solving this question and this is one way to solve it. Let's say I, you know, write down uh, my solution here where I use for loop and I do all the if and else and everything. Now I want to see if it is, you know, uh, correct or not. I run the test cases here on which are inbuilt in the platform and it says that all the eight test cases are passing. So now this is all well and good. All the test cases are passing, but can I improve upon the solution? Maybe rather than using for loop, I can, I might have used some higher order functions or maybe some performance improvements here or some security is there memory leak or something like that. So one possible solution is that I go to submissions here and I see all submissions. So these are the submissions posted by different users on the platform. You can go click on view and you can check those out. So that is valid and you can compare what is working for you and what is not working for them or vice versa and you can pick uh, ideas. Another way, uh, what could be another way? You know, in, in an organization, it is, we always get, you know, code reviews from our senior engineers or peer, peer group. So in the DevTools Tech platform, we have this new feature that is live. So we have a new tab here called code review. If I go here, it says that, uh, you know, code as usual receives smart feedback. So basically, uh, this is an AI model, uh, DevTools AI, which is running in the background on my own server. And when we click on this CTA, let me just click on it. Then we get this loading state. And right away, we feed this code to the AI model and we ask the model to review the code and provide suggestions. Now, uh, I, like here it's mentioned that it's an early beta so expect things to break but for the most part it works fine and you know I have the streaming uh, support also so that you can get a uh, you know right away feedback I'm, I'm trying to run a good model with streaming support and uh, on the best possible hardware I can get and uh, see we are getting the code review here we are getting the code quality performance maintainability best practices and so on and the some suggestion and explanation of the changes this is in beta and this is live for all the programming questions be it html css react javascript here you know, right now it's not conversational uh, i'm planning to make it conversational depending on the feedback from the users that uh, you can ask follow-up questions you can ask why uh, ai is suggesting something or not i would definitely urge you to go, go on the platform, register and solve any question and then ask AI to review it and see how can you improve. And also this is free for now completely. I am running it on my own server. I am paying it out of my own pocket. However, this is not a, you know, a cheap uh, or not a cost effective uh, feature to run. It's expensive. The models I'm trying to use state of the art models like Code Llama, code gamma and other things so if you would like to support then you can click on this link and it will take you to a top mid page where you can you know support the platform and uh, help me keep it free for all the users and help me uh, bring a more state of the art model and a faster model for you so try it out give me feedback uh, what all features do you want how else you can think that this would help you uh, and looking forward to your feedback.